War number nine, season 24. Uh, this one we're going up, up against New Nation. Uh, pretty competitive war, pretty pretty important war. Uh, I was on backup in section one, and in section two I have two fights, and I also have two mini boss fights. This is the thing on uh, Ebb and Flow Intercept. I don't have Falcon with me today, so I'm gonna be uh, I'm gonna be using Omega to take down this thing. I'm gonna just you know very much slow play it, as slow as I can go, <laughs> basically. I do go for like one or two intercepts towards the end because I just kind of get bored. But uh, yeah, that's that's not uh, like I just went for pretty safe intercepts in in my opinion. Yeah, so here I'm just gonna be baiting his special one whenever he has those 15 rock charges. <laughs> he really does not want to throw the special one today, so that's that's also pretty fun. But uh, yeah, I'm just gonna be doing my spore damage. Uh, the spore damage uh, it it gets through a lot of the the protection from the from the ebb and flow intercept node, so I don't necessarily have to worry too much about like timing out and stuff like that. Uh, so right now, like a minute twelve is gone, and thing is down thirty three percent. So by that logic, uh, thing should be down uh, completely. In, in around three minutes and 30 seconds, right? So here yeah, I'm just gonna, you know, go for another heavy. I'm gonna save my SP3 in case I get uh, backed up against the corner. I don't think I will use it because it does get rid of my spores on him. So I don't wanna, I don't wanna have to have to ramp those up again. But there I went for my intercept. Uh, now you see the spores are dealing their full damage. I, I went for a heavy while the the ebb and flow node is down and yeah that did some that did some decent damage all right and uh yeah the fight's gonna be almost over it's a pretty long fight pretty pretty uneventful fight but given the 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 not uh uneventfulness of the, <laughs> the remaining three fights coming up well, actually, the eventfulness of the remaining three fights coming up, I, I very much would rather have an uneventful fight than, than something that would make me need a change of pants. There, I, I uh, fully dexed the SP1 in the corner, and then I went for the SP3 to finish off the fight, and this is gonna be this is gonna be killing him right here. After this fight, I had to wait for Karate Mike to take down a Hulkbuster uh, on the next ebb and flow intercept node. And uh, yeah, there I also noticed that my, my volume was on. I was very concerned that like my phone was making like sounds when I'm fighting, and I I never have the audio the volume on, so it was it was pretty scary for me. All right, yeah, this ebb and flow <laughs> intercept Nick Fury. At some point, it goes very south, so I'm not using an invulnerability boost here. Invulnerability in one like the the three minute boost. The invulnerability, the the power start one, to a lesser extent, the, the combat region, are incredibly rare, and uh, the judgment call to use them or not use them is often like determined by where we are in the war, uh, how the war is looking. And at this rate, at this point, I was pretty sure that we were going to be losing, and I had two invulnerability boosts in my inventory, and I decided not to use one. I wasn't I wasn't told to use one. So I wasn't going up against, you know, uh, an officer's decision here, but uh, this fight, this fight goes pretty, goes pretty south at some point. So here I'm just, you know, doing my doing my combos, uh, landing a heavy whenever I can, I can bait a heavy from him. Uh, there he throws the SP1, but right after the SP1 animation, he's going to be going in the second life. Now you see this fight, and you're like, hmm, that's not too bad, right? Uh, it's not going too bad. But there, he throws SP1, he is completely unblockable. I do eat it to the face. It doesn't deal too much damage, and I'm also healing a bit with the Disorient and also the Armor Break uh, debuff on me. And here. I'm, I don't know why I went for a light attack there. I, I Was I trying to go for a heavy, but then it registered as a light? Is that what happened? I don't know what happened there, but yeah, I lose basically most of my health. He's in the second phase, he's furious, 
and he has a protection up and I'm trying to push him to his SP2. <laughs> It's barely not getting there. I do finally push him to the SP2. He throws the SP2. He's pretty cooperative. Here I'm like, I have to go for an intercept and actually deal full damage if I want to get this fight down uh, without, you know, risking additional, you know, SP1 damage or something like that. And yeah, that's, that's done. Good God, that was stressful. I need the, the, just the whole different pants after that. Speaking of stressful, this fight on the Rage mini boss. The Rage mini boss, first of all, my first big mistake, I boosted my attack. I boosted my attack with some, some medium attack boost and also the 30% health and attack boost. I should not have boosted my attack. <laughs> and second mistake, we'll see when it comes up. This fight I'm just, you know, doing normally, uh, going about the, the fight pretty normally. I'm not encountering his heavies with my heavy because I know Killmonger can at times be a bit of a pain and like throw the special mid heavy animation. There. Bam. <laughs> I get a little greedy with the stun duration and he comes out of it right away and smacks me in the face with one SP1 and I'm at this point I'm like in fight or flight. I'm like am I gonna make it? This is gonna be this is gonna be my second war of the second de death of the season and he goes down. <laughs> that was a nightmare right there. <laughs> that was a nightmare fight right there. That void I'm not taking. Uh, that void somebody with Nick Fury took. Here again. Uh, this is a fight where normally I'd be using uh, Power Start 1. Because of the improved power gain on Sorcerer Supreme. But I only have one Power Start 1 on my inventory. It's been a while since they were available in the store. I, we, I know we have lost this war at this point, so I'm not using the power start one. I did use a special three defense boost, and uh, my 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 plan here is just to build up my power as quickly as possible. And there I make a mistake. There I didn't make a mistake by baiting the SP1. There I made a mistake by dexing the SP1. The final hit I dexed, and she gets that massive. <laughs> Massive burst of MD MD power on top of you know the improved power gain she has, and I'm getting to my SP2 just in time to to lock things down uh, after after she throws SP2. Thankfully she's pretty cooperative. The node does have SP2 bias. I'm not quite sure if the if the power start one is actually essential here when it comes to taking this node. I'm just going through my SP2 uh, rotation. I do have the mystic power boost on. I do have the champion boost and the attack boost and stuff like that done, so it's not it's not too too bad here. And yeah, uh, I'm getting to my SP2s pretty reliably. The one node that could mess things up here, if you don't use the power start one, is the aspect of evolution. Now, aspect of evolution is going to be giving her like extra armor rating and extra crit resist uh, based on the number of bars of power she has filled in the fight. So uh, yeah, that's that's kind of. That's kind of a way to mess things up in this fight. All right, yeah, we did lose this war, but it was pretty close as far as I know. Um, well, at this point of the war, I think like we have done 100 and 110 fights. We have died nine times. They have done 135-ish fights, and they have done th they have died three times. And we also tied the previous war with Kenobi. We both died four times, so that's a loss for us as well. Um, yeah, that's about it. I'm pretty proud of how we've been performing in the Alliance Wars. Um, not necessarily proud of how I did here, how I performed here, and I guess my voice is gone too. So yeah, I'll throw up the, the stats for uh, Wars 1 through 8 up in the, up in the statute up above. And thanks for all for watching. I'll catch you later. Bye.